Welcome back to another Senior Spotlight. I'm your host, Leah Bogosian, and I'm here with senior softball player, Brielle Jungblatt. Brielle, thank you for coming today. Thank you for having me. So, um, tell me a little about yourself. Okay, so I'm a senior. I play outfield. I'm 23 years old. I'm from Ridgeland, South Carolina, and I went to a private school called Tom Hayward Academy, and here I am. Wow, that's interesting. Um, <laughs> why did you choose USC Aiken? Um, I actually chose Aiken just because it wasn't too far from home. My original plan was just just to stay here for a semester, but um, I ended up playing softball, and here I am five years later. <laughs> that's great that it's not too far. Right. Um, so what's your major? I'm a communication major with a business minor. Go calm. Wow. <laughs> Why did you choose communications? Um, well, I originally was an education major. Wow. I quickly found out that it just wasn't for me. <laughs> so then I switched to calm just to switch, but eventually I grew to love it and I literally just am obsessed with the whole department. So I really love my major. That's great. Go calm. Any particular person who's helped you at your time here at USC Aiken? Yeah, I have a couple people actually. So first I would thank Brent Hager. He's just been like my rock throughout this whole experience. Um, he's given me opportunities that I'm forever thankful for. Um, my coach, Jerry Snyder, um, he's given me a lot of opportunities as well. And I'm super glad that he didn't give up on me. Um, and then my professor wise, it would probably be Dr. Wilson, Professor Webb, Dr. Triana. Like I said earlier, our comm department is just Super helpful and super great. I recommend Calm to anybody. And then, of course, my mom and my family. That's great to have an endless support system right. throughout your whole college experience. I needed that, too. Yeah. Um, so how long have you played softball? I started playing when I was, like, 11 or 12. So I think I kind of got a late start compared to everybody else. Oh, yeah. Um, but, yep, I was 12. That's, that's kind of young. <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> Um, Ten years later, so. <laughs> Did you play any other sports? Yes, I had a very strong passion for basketball. Played that in high school. My team did very well my junior and senior year, but here I am playing softball. I heard you were great at basketball, but why, what made you choose softball over basketball? Well, I actually didn't choose any of those sports. I originally had a plan just to come to college to be a regular student just because my whole life, it just consisted of going to practice, going to games, like, oh, yeah. not having really like a social life. So I was set in stone. I was like, you know what? I'm done with sports. I just want to experience <laughs> just being a student. But I quickly learned that it just wasn't for me. Mm -hmm. So that's when I got in, in touch with Coach Schneider. And um, he offered me a tryout, and I took advantage of it, and I made the team. I would have loved to try out for basketball, but... I have like a height advantage or disadvantage, <laughs> sorry. So. Well, here we are now. I'm glad you came here. Yeah, me too. Well, I had to say thank you to Coach Schneider. <laughs> <laughs> um, so what are your goals for your senior season? I would love to bat over 400. That'd be like great. Um, obviously no errors. <laughs> I would really love for my team to bat as a whole over 350. And I would really love to win conference and make it to the region tournament. Those are ultimate goals. Yes. Um, Got to do it. I agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> How are you taking on your senior role this year? Well, it's been a long journey, so to finally reach that senior, senior stepping stone is, like, really humbling and exciting mm -hmm. all at once. So I just really try to be there for anybody younger than me that has any questions. I try to lead by example. Um, I just really try to help others. It's great to have you as a leader because I needed that my freshman year. All the freshmen need it. I needed to get through college. Well, thank you. Um, Hopefully I'm doing a good job. A good you job. are. You're doing a great job. <laughs> um, so what are your plans after graduation? Well, I want to go into sports reporting, sports broadcasting, anything with sports really just because I'm super passionate about all types. I don't have a preference on where to live. Like, I could literally live mm -hmm. anywhere in this country oh, yes. and be completely happy because I know I can always come home. So I know what field I want to go into, but I don't know exactly where. Those are great plans. Some people right. don't know, you know, what they're right. going to do yet. So that's great. Um, what's your favorite memory at USC Aiken? Favorite memory? 
I don't think I could really just pinpoint one memory. Um, I could say a couple different things. I love traveling with my team. <laughs> <laughs> when I say that there is no team like my team, <laughs> I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Um, <laughs> one of my other favorite memories was my freshman year. We were playing Georgia College, and we were down by like six in the last inning, and we came back and won with like two outs. Um, I don't know. I just can't really just say just one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That seems like one of the most exciting experiences, honestly. Yeah, it really to be is. with your team. I, there's no team. I wish I was there. That's all I have to honestly. say. Oh, yeah. Especially no my, my younger years. Those are my people. It was the best, <laughs> right? It's the best experience. Um, how do you want to be remembered here at USC Aiken? Um, I kind of want to be remembered as an example. Like I said, I didn't really take school very seriously. Um, but I'm on the right track now. So I would really like people to look at me and be like, you know what, like, she overcame a lot of things, and she's successful now. So I'd really like to be remembered like that. I also want her to be remembered as someone who's positive and happy and try to make people laugh all the time. <laughs> um, so I'd say that's how I want to be remembered. Yeah, it's inspiring how you started from the bottom, and you just, you're here now. Yeah. Like, you're successful. Yeah, it was a you long time. You know what you're going to do. <laughs> <laughs> um, describe your time here at USC Aiken in one word. One word, Okay. I would describe my time here as, what word would I choose? Um, survival. <laughs> like, I made it. <laughs> That's the best word. <laughs> that is the best word. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um, that wraps things up for another Senior Spotlight. Tune in next time. There we go.